Welcome back to the channel, my friends. Deer camp has come and gone. Now it's time to get out there and dash. I'm gonna be using all the tools in my tool belt today. The little DoorDash, Grubhub, and the new ones. Gotta get out there and make this beautiful Sunday happen. So sit back and enjoy because now it's time Happy Sunday, everybody. Guess who's back? Back again. It's 1044. I got to go gas up, get some uh, snacks. I'm going to go out and do some stashing through the snow. Had a really good uh, week-long vacation up hunting. Get to that later. And uh, now I got to make some money. Let's do it. It is 1053. I've got myself scheduled today from 11 till 930. I don't know if we're going to go that long. I'm definitely going to try to make some honey today. Um, I just gassed up. And I'm about to go play this game. I'm going to go a different direction than I normally do. Change things up a little bit today. It's hunting season. I uh, got some meat in the freezer. I had some wonderful opportunities at uh, three different really nice shooter bucks. Uh, I didn't get any, any of them. I uh, did take a nice big fat uh, three and a half year old doe. So that's good. Uh, now I got to make some dough. Speaking of dough, let's, oh, it's going to let me in early. Sweet. It always does 15 minutes early. All right, it is 1054. We're starting the money machine, baby. Let's roll. My first order is ridiculously long, but I'm taking it. It's $14.50. I didn't even look at the miles, but it's taking me way up into Farmington. If I was a top dasher, that'd be great. Because then I could just end my dash and start a dash up in Farmington there with no worries about not being able to get in. But uh, I'm not a top dasher. So um, this order is horrible. Well, it's definitely winter time here in Michigan. Shut your face, Google. I'm trying to talk. Um, so I just want to remind everybody: make sure you're you're being extra safe, being aware, uh, looking out for black ice, being aware of other drivers around you. Because it's not always you. I mean, it, you can be the safest driver in the world, and it just takes some idiot, Google. Just take some idiot to come in there and mess your day up. So, just be safe. It is 11.34. We got both those orders dropped off for $14.50 as promised. Normally, I'd be giddy if I was a top dasher because I'm up here in a good zone. I, now, don't get me wrong. I'm going to pick up another order, but it's going to be a long mile order taking me back into my zone from here. But if I was a top dasher and didn't have to worry about, like, if I end my dash in Livonia... I won't be able to start up again if it's not busy, right? If I'm not a top dasher. So one of the perks to the top dasher thing that I really love is being able to hop zones, man. You end your dash when you want, start up again when you want. I can't do that right now and it really sucks because I am pretty deep in a, a, a zone where I can pick up some bangers and now I'm just gonna be left picking up scraps from, um, long mile orders that are going to take me back back into my zone which is fine we'll, we'll do that but it's 11 34 baby let's go make some more money seeing how i can't just end my dash and start my dash whenever i want this is a highway right here that's going to take me back into my zone and instead of getting caught by a stupid order once i get on the highway that's going to ask me to get off the highway and get back over here. I'm going to pause my dash and use the highway to get back to a good part of my zone. I feel like that's the right thing to do, although I'm sad that I'm not top dasher because uh, I could pick up some pretty good orders where I'm at right now. I'm kind of torn. Uh, dude next to me is jamming. He's got the beats going. So... <sighs> And it is 11.45 and we just picked up a $7.50 showing. 
Little Caesars order, going 5.6 miles, sucks. But taking me to a good area where hopefully I can pick up a good order. Yeah, let's play the game, baby. It's 11.53 and I got here to Little Caesars and they gave me an add-on for Arby's for $6.50, uh, going 2.2 additional miles. So I took it. We'll see what Arby's is like after I get this Little Caesars here. You know what I'm saying? Must say, not bad. It's 12.03. Arby's inside was open. Order was ready. Little Caesars order was ready. Three minutes away from the Little Caesars drop-off. Let's have a good day. Yeah. Let's just hope everybody has a good day today. I kind of feel like rusty, right? Because I've been on vacation and tromping through the woods all week. And I didn't really do a whole lot of dashing the week before. Sure, Google. I'll do, I'll, I'll do that. I would love to. Turn right onto Sheldon Road. Da, 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 da. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Westminster Way. Alrighty. I uh, ADHD is gone. Yeah, it'll come back to me. Twelve oh nine. Got seven fifty for that, as promised, and we're two minutes away from that additional six fifty, baby. Let's do it. It's twelve fourteen. We got that dropped off for six fifty. We're at twenty eight fifty, and uh, just got a Dash Mart stack order for thirteen dollars, going nine point nine miles. That's not good. I'm taking it though, cause I'm trying to get back up. I don't know how much time I'm gonna have for dashing between work and stuff this week. It's gonna be pretty busy. And I'm hunting again this coming weekend, so I need to start kind of uh, being selective on how much declining I do. This one's okay. I mean, 13 bucks. The area it's taking me to, I can get another good order. I'm gonna play that game, baby. You know, I don't mind the Dash Mart at all, man. Everything was in out. Both orders were ready. Yeah, it's 12:21. Let's play this game, baby. 1231 I got that dropped off for six bucks 10 minutes away from uh, another seven I don't know if you guys can see how nasty my windshield is or not Dasher tip make sure you got enough windshield washer fluid when you're driving in this shit because all the road salts and everything just splash up and you gotta Use it constantly just to clean your windshield off that be snowy dirt and mud all over it so uh, I just made a quick pit stop to uh, refill mine because it ran out. Let's play the game, baby. Oh, yeah, that's kind of better. All right, it's 12.47. We are about two hours in at 41.50. And I just got an offer stack order from Pizza Hut. Showing 18.50 for nine miles, taking me over to No Tip Strip. I took it. I think I'm gonna pause my dash after the delivery to jump the highway and get back over to my sweet spot. But 18.50, I can do that in less than a half hour, hopefully, if everything's ready. So let's play this game, baby. It's 12.48. All right, it's 1.22. I got that dropped off for 18.50, as promised. And uh, I paused my dash, I'm headed to the highway, gonna shoot over to the good end of my zone, and I'm dealing with customer support. Uh, what happened was, uh, so this Pizza Hut order was through the PizzaHut.com website, not through DoorDash, Pizza Hut shipped it out through DoorDash. So on our end, when we get orders like that, uh, first of all, the names are all in capital letters. Uh, second of all, it says item count unavailable. So we have no item count to reference on our app as far as what what we're supposed to be picking up. We just have to rely on Pizza Hut to give us what they're supposed to give us. Well, my customer did not receive her two liter of Pepsi. And I said, I am so sorry, ma'am. And I showed her on my, my phone. I was like, it, it tells me item count unavailable. I said, you must have ordered through Pizza Hut's online website, correct? And she said, yeah, yeah, I did. I said, okay, well, I will contact support on my end, but they're gonna direct me to tell you to contact Pizza Hut directly because you ordered through them and then they 
sublet the delivery out to DoorDash. Uh, but they should take care of you. So I did that with the customer and now I'm contacting support while I'm driving uh, to the other end of my zone just to make sure my ass is covered so Pizza Hut doesn't try to say that, oh yeah, he stole the two liter or whatever, but yeah, you know, gotta play the game, baby. Homelessness is definitely an issue out here. I feel bad, it's cold, it's, it's 24 degrees out here and there's people out holding signs on street corners. It's pretty sad. I'm unpausing my dash. I went even deeper. Man, it wants to bring me right back. 1475 from the pizza spot. Alright. Son of a bitch. 1475 going nine miles from the pizza spot in Plymouth. I like that store. Let's play it. 145. I love the guys at the pizza spot, man. And the pizza here's so good. They got it by the slice. I got this order picked up. I'm 14 minutes away from drop off and I got a little lunch on the way. Hell yeah. Ugh. Anybody like the crust? I'm not a big crust guy unless I got some like buttery, cheesy, saucy shit to dip it in. Pizza spot pizza's on point, bro. Just saying. Six minutes to go. Touchdown Lions, that went up to, uh... all right, we'll do it, uh, $14.75, and I got a Buddy's Pizza showing $8.50, going 8.2 miles, I like Buddy's Pizza because I might get a stack from there, so we're going to take it, we're going to take it. It is uh, 219 and we are at 8325, baby. Uber Eats seems to be hopping. I didn't, I turned it on for a second and it, it was going nuts. So, um, yeah, I might have to start multi apping. Hell yeah, it's 223. The Lions just scored another touchdown. And uh, we picked up a Papa John showing seven something for 3.6 miles. Going in the direction I want to go. Gonna play that game. Do, 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 do. Ba, 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 banger alert. That went up to 18 something. We'll take that, baby. It's 236. And I just got a, a crap order. Showing 775, going eight miles. Ain't going up. It's from Rajah Palace, taking me to a bad area. But I took it. I just, I got, I just got hit with a really nice order. Vibes are flowing and high. Maybe there's a reason for it. We're taking it, baby. Let's do it. It's 2.37. Lions are winning. It's halftime. Hell yeah. 3 o'clock, 3.05, something like that. And it made me end my dash for some reason. Uh, but it is allowing me to get back in. Um, so I ended at 109 bucks. That's not bad for four hours. Pretty good. Restarting my dash and it's sending me some crap so i think i am going to pause my dash and get the hell away from this area let's play that game what do you do to fill your boring time i do dumb shit like that all right it's 312 and I've had to decline the last like six DoorDash offers. So I fired up the Uber Eats and the Grubhub. And I just took an Uber Eats order, long miles, but from a good restaurant uh, from Carabas. It's showing $11 and something. I'm hoping it's going up. I don't know. We're going to play that game. See what we can get done, baby. Multi happen. What? It's 3.40. Got that Uber Eats dropped off. Says I got three fifty nine for it, but it was showing me eleven something on the offer. See if it goes up later. I don't know. Anyway, the DoorDash is on. It's three forty two. It's the dead time of the day for about another hour, hour and a half or so. Uh, we're gonna play that game, baby. Three forty seven. I uh, just got a big Laura offer. I think eleven, eleven fifty. 
Yeah, 11.50 it's showing me for seven miles. We're gonna take that one. Let's play that game, baby. It's 3.47. Shut your face, Google. You done? 4.09. I got that dropped off for 11.50. And then I picked up a $4 and something order for Tropical Smoothie Cafe because it is on my way back. I am way out here in Northville, so why not, baby? It's $4.10. So taking this order is a good example of, of what I say, make decisions that are right for you. It's a, it's a crappy-ass $4 order, right? And a lot of people, you know, call you names or whatever. That's dumb. But for me, it makes sense. It's going in the right direction back. It's, it's a decision I feel that was right for me. So that's why I took this order. And I hope, and I know everybody makes decisions like that. You know what I mean? So, just letting you know. It's 423, we got that dropped off for four something. We're at uh, 1625 plus the 109 plus the 11 something from Uber Eats. Not doing bad. Playing a game, baby. <laughs> Mega multi app episode special. I just took a Grubhub order. I don't know if I screenshot this or not. Uh, but it's a $17 Grubhub order, so I took it. Why not put a little Grubhub and Ubers? I'm in Outback. And uh, Grubhub sent me a stack order for Chipotle for eight bucks for three miles. We'll take that too. Grubhub and Ubers, hell yeah! Multi app. It's 5:03. I got that first Grubhub dropped off. I'm seven minutes away from the second. Well, I, I'm. We'll check out the totals in a minute. Okay, I hear you, Grubhub. They just pop up with a $22 order from the Boneyard going 13 miles. I'll do it. Grub up trying to keep me busy. Huh. I didn't look where it was taking me. That was dumb. We'll figure it out. Yep. Always look before you accept, man. This is a stack order and it's taking me way out to the ghetto to no tip strip and all that fun stuff, so... And it's 22 bucks for 13 miles. I'll take it and do it, but uh, it's going to be time to get back into doing some DoorDash. It'll be interesting to see what Grubhub sends me, but we'll see. It's 516, and I'm almost to the boneyard. I stopped home to pee and give the wife a kiss. All right, it's 534. I got both of these Grubhub orders in my car, getting ready to drop them off. And uh, mom was making steak, so we're going to pause the action for a little while, go home for some dinner, and then try to get back out for some door dashing this evening. Let's play that game, baby. All right, I made like 48 bucks on Grubhub today so far, and uh, Uber Eats just came through with an order taking me back towards home so I can go get some dinner for 15 bucks. Um, that first Uber Eats order went up to $14. Okay, thanks, Google, or whatever your Uber Eats system is. But yeah, I just took a $15 Uber Eats order, taking me back towards home. So, playing that game, it's 6 o'clock, baby. It's 6.30, got that delivered. Um, I'm going to stop here for a while. I'm going to do some grocery shopping, stop home for dinner, maybe get out for an evening dash with DoorDash. Let's play this game, baby. Nice little dinner break, it's 7.22 now. Just pulling back on my driveway. Fired up the money machine, got Ubers on. Might even turn Grubhub's back on. But I want to work on my Dash account. I want to get it up there. So we're going to just do DoorDash and Ubers right now. 729, I took a dumb DoorDash order for 350 from Hungry Howie's. It's taking me out towards Plymouth. It's in the direction I'm moving, so I took it because I want to move this way. I had to decline like five on the way. Uber Eats has been pretty explosive tonight, but long mile offers, and I just can't do that, so, yep. Uh, 7.41, I got my $3.50 as promised. Let's move on. Taking a little Caesar's 6.50 for three miles. 
not happy about it. I'll take it. Yeah, I got to Little Caesars. He said it was going to be another 10 to 15 minutes. I ought to sign that order. On a sign, don't wait in line, baby. Waste my time, damn it. 7.54, we picked up a big Laura. We're gonna take that one. See what Grubhub's chiming in all about here. Uh, nothing, I guess, all right. All right, I got 7.75, it's 8.18, and I'm picking up a Honey Tree Grill for 5.75, going three miles. Let's play this game. 824 I'm picking up at Honey Tree and they tacked on a wing boss for 775. Let's play that game. 838 I got that dropped off for 575 and we're nine minutes away from my uh 775. Whew. Let's play that game, baby. It's nine o'clock. I'm doing some accidental dirty apping right now. I accidentally accepted a Grubhub offer for two miles while I'm on a DoorDash order. Uh so hopefully I don't get too pissed. As long as the drive through isn't bad at Arby's, we should be good. Let's play that game. It's 9.07 and I got the Grubhub dropped off that I accidentally picked up. And now I'm four minutes away from my DoorDash order, which doesn't have to be delivered till 9.16, so I think we'll be all right. Dirty app and getting away with it, baby. 911 got that dropped off for five dollars. Zero tip on that. They backed money out of that. How the hell is that? Zero tip. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna maybe do one more order and call it a Sunday, man. It's been over two hundred dollars today, I'm sure. A little multi app and madness, crazy shit going on. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Glad to be back, man. I enjoyed my week off of hunting. I haven't put a video out in a little while, uh, but there'll be more to come, trust me. We got Christmas coming. It's gonna be mad Christmas dashing going on. Fun stuff. For one mile. Just took a not worth it Dash Mart order, uh, only because it's taking me right towards home. It's long miles, but I'm quite a ways away from home. This order's taking me close to my home, so play the game and probably end it right there we'll see how we go when we get home we'll go over the numbers it is 9:36. got that dropped off six dollars no tip and the night there uh get back to my driveway we'll go over the numbers of the total day today so it's been an okay day all right guys i'm home it's a pretty good day of dashing uh let's go over over the numbers here, uh, Uber Eats came in today at $29.93, followed up by Grubhub at $54.62, and then as always, DoorDash for the win, $161.50. I think that comes to $246 and some change. Not a bad day of dashing. I took some breaks. I stopped and had dinner with the family. I started at 11 o'clock this morning. Ended around 9.30. Made some decisions that I felt were right for me. Some of them probably weren't. But uh, it's all part of the game, baby. I'll be multi app it a little bit more. Uber Eats seems to be picking up. Grubhub ain't doing too bad either. They kept me busy for a good part of the day. I do want to try to make Top Dasher for next month. I'll be doing a lot of dashing, and I definitely, um, I like being able to end my dash and zone hop and all those different things. So, yeah, I hope everybody's doing well. I hope you guys are out there making money. Uh, I'll be putting out more content as soon as I can. But, uh, till next time, my friends, play that game.